Welcome back everyone. I hope you had a great day today. We woke up into the 50s and 60s a nice comfortable morning temperature almost or it is 10 degrees above normal in Milwaukee. So we continue with those warm nights in the city, but the outlying areas are comfortable. Clear sky today and temperature 76 humidity low a year ago today. We were almost at 80 degrees. Obviously no precipitation today, and I don't think we're going to see any before midnight, but there is rain in the forecast. Waukesha looking beautiful as well. Temperature there 75 dew point in the low 50s and the wind is light. We have high pressure right over us, giving us a nice clear sky. Hey, Whitewater hit 81. Fond du Lac's at 78, Kenosha 74, and Sheboygan at 77. Here's the setup. We have the high pressure right over us, giving us the clear sky and the light breeze. Notice there's some rain to the north. That's where that stays. But there's also rain right along the Minnesota-Iowa border with this warm front, and that will hold together and be here late night to early, early morning. So you could see a few scattered rain showers for the morning commute. 20 to 25%, not that big of a deal. And then a little bump in that up to 30% around 9, 10, 11, and then is out of here in the afternoon. So not a big deal, but just be prepared for a few scattered showers in the morning. The heat is bottled up down to the south. St. Louis, 94, Kansas City, almost 100 today, 93 in North Platte, Nebraska, but we're in the 70s and 80s. That's a beautiful mid to late September day, and we're going to keep those temperatures a rather warm for this time of the year for another day or so and then we'll start to cool things down. But with the dry air still in place for today, temperatures tonight drop back into the 50s and right around 60 degrees in Racine, 58 in Sheboygan. And yes, there could be a few showers right around sunrise tomorrow morning. Once that gets out of here, plenty of sunshine in the afternoon. We'll call it partly cloudy. Southwest winds get a little gusty. There'll be 15, 20, maybe 25 miles per hour, and that'll bring in a high of 82. And if you get a little bit of morning rain, that's going to bump up that humidity almost to steamy. And this might be the last time I have to show this dew point forecast for the season because then here comes some dry Canadian air with dew points in the 40s. And you know what that means? Low temperatures could be in the 40s as well in just a couple of days. Temperatures tonight, upper 50s to lower 60s, some scattered showers by morning, maybe a rumble of thunder, and then by afternoon becoming sunny, humid, breezy, upper 70s to lower 80s. The seven day forecast, 75 with a few isolated showers on Wednesday. Look at Thursday, hello fall, 62 degrees. 40s when you wake up Friday morning, 63 could see some rain for the first time for Friday frenzy. Lance might need the umbrella.